Hey everyone, Tech Domenger here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add, remove, edit widgets on iOS 26, the latest version. So let's get started. So you might see these bigger widgets now available. This was available on previous iOS versions. So if you're wondering how to first add one, this is how you're going to do it. You're going to pick any app on your iPhone, doesn't matter. And the key here is to long press and hold on to that app. And when you do that, a menu will pop up. That should give you an option that says edit home screen. So we're going to click on edit home screen. And when we do that, we're going to see the app jiggle a little bit. But up top here, you're going to see edit options. We're going to click on that edit. And finally, from there on, we're going to see an option that says add widget. So if I want to add a widget, I can simply just click on it. And it gives me quite a few widgets I can add from. So I can see the list of widgets available here. Uh, you can look through it or search for it. Let's say I want to add a clock widget, just like that. Now, when it comes to some widget, you'll have different options. So you can swipe through each option that you like. For example, maybe I like this one, and I'm going to click on Add. And now, as you can see here, that widget has been added. Just like with the app, you can actually move this widget around to find the perfect placement for it. So let's say I want to place it maybe here, right? And then once you're done, you just click on the word Done, and now we have a widget available here. Now, you might be sometime editing the widget. So in order to edit, edit a widget, you're going to long press and hold onto that widget. And then you have the option to again edit it again directly. Click on Edit Widget. And when you do that, for example, this is a clock app, so which I can change the location of this clock by tapping on the city. And then the update time will show up for that. Additionally, if I want to change the size, I can you know, long press and hold. Click on maybe a bigger size based on that, or go for the small size and it's tiny like that. You can do that as well. I can also long press and hold and then click on Edit Home Screen and then click on Edit again, add a widget, and I can add another widget if I want. Let's go ahead and another add widget here. Click on Add Widget. And then let's go back and change the size of this widget again by long pressing. And then we're going to make it bigger. So I can have three widgets. And the same thing, I can move the widgets around just like I would on this page. Or I can even move it to another page. And when I'm done, I'm going to click on Done. Now you might be looking to remove a widget, which is, again, all you're going to do is locate the widget and long press and hold. And all you do is click on Remove Widget. And then click on Remove. And now I have removed the widget. So those are different ways to add, edit, remove widget on iOS 26. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.